what's going on folks today is day 86 <laughs> I think I think it's 86 uh, let me check and make sure real quick it is quiet around the YouTube community on a Sunday I tell you that much Ugh. Somehow I got a player open on YouTube. But anyway, uh, I really don't have much to say today. Uh, yeah, I know. Even I can't think of nothing to say today. Uh, it's been a good weekend. Uh, good quiet weekend, you know. Uh, things seem to be going good at home. Uh, I used up uh, the last coupon I could possibly use for Subway today where I cut up those uh, several weeks back uh, they expired on the 27th and that is today uh, so I went there and I used uh, a three sub coupon uh, three foot longs for uh, seventeen dollars and some change uh, I got my son a meatball and my wife wanted a steak and cheese and I got myself a foot-long BMT tell you I ate that uh, foot-long BMT around uh, 2 p.m. this afternoon uh, <laughs> and uh, I decided to go ahead and eat the entire foot-long for one meal so I was done eating about 2 30 so uh, uh, that foot-long sub will count as an OMAD day for me one meal for today uh, we didn't get to get out till later. Uh, my daughter slept in, like way in. <laughs> she was late getting up this morning, so uh, I was late getting the subway. And uh, yeah, so uh, it was definitely an OMAD day. Uh, see where uh, Tiff put out a video this morning. Uh, got to under 200 pounds. I'm so proud of her. Uh, way to go, Tiff. Uh, You've been with me since the beginning, and uh, <laughs> I cannot begin to tell you how proud of you I am. Uh, I weighed this morning. I'm still struggling to get back down to that uh, 286. Uh, don't know if I'm actually going to make it back down there by in the morning or not. Uh, but I'm only like a pound off. Uh, so I've hit a bit of a plateau. And it seems like uh, when you do those extracurricular activity <laughs> weekends, that type of thing occurs. Uh, I notice I've not been the only one that experienced that. So uh, I'm hopeful to break through that over the next coming week 
and be able to uh, push forward toward uh, 50 pounds of weight loss. That is my goal uh, going into next month. So uh, I got a few days left within the month of March. I'd like to uh, definitely get that back down uh, to where it was uh, so I can continue counting my forward progress instead of backward progress going forward. <laughs> <laughs> if that makes sense to you but uh yeah it's uh been an interesting weekend for sure um uh, but you know I, I hope everybody out there is uh doing well and uh i hope your uh diets are going better than mine right now which you know, i can't complain i mean uh, I dropped back down uh, to uh, 287 and I'm holding steady there 287.8 so I would like to get that down a little further uh, I started drinking my coffee again this morning that's one thing I've done different I started doing that because uh, all last week I did not drink my uh, black coffee that black coffee really helps to uh, increase stomach acid and get the uh, digestive system going and that's what happened uh, this morning I, I drank two cups of black coffee and uh, I guess when I get done gabbing here I will go uh, drink a couple of ca uh, cups of decaffeinated I've seen where uh, de decaffeinated has the uh, same uh, gut health benefits that the uh, caffeinated has so uh, drinking a couple of cups of that uh, tonight uh, on top of all those fermented vegetables that I had at one time in one setting <laughs> should uh, go a long way toward uh, digestion and uh, helping me to get back where I need to be. I uh, definitely got to uh, start practicing uh, my method a little better. I've slipped with it a lot uh, over the week. Not my eating window though. I'm fine in my eating window of course uh, and, and I'm fine with my meals doing uh, doing the two med but I, I really really can tell a difference by not uh, implementing that black coffee into the diet so that is a must uh, to start back with going into uh, this coming week and that started today because today is technically the beginning of a new week and uh, also I took my ginger and cinnamon this morning I will take another two of those supplements tonight uh, as I'm going to bed both of those actually help with uh, gut health and uh, digestion as well uh, I take those in supplement form I've uh, talked about it in the past but I feel like they're very effective uh, going into your system along with the black coffee toward uh, actually helping you with the results and we may see some in the morning because uh, I started uh, doing that again at least that's what I'm hoping for uh, that plus uh, having all my food in one setting today uh, should go a long way toward uh, helping me achieve uh, that 186 again I, at this point I'd just uh, be happy to see that 186 show back up on the scale and I'm not far from that so it's very possible in the morning that we could see that. Uh, but I won't complain if it's less than that. <laughs> no, I won't complain about that at all. Um, and my wife is doing good. Uh, she is uh, stabilized with the medication that she is on. And she herself, I think, she counted up her weight loss and has lost a total of uh, about 15 or 16 pounds. Uh, since she started hitting this intermittent fasting heavy with me so uh, she is still uh, even though she's going through this you know practicing the uh, diet with me her she's a little uh, she's not as strict as I am but she's been declining about one two and three pounds a week you know depending on uh, uh, how her body decides to get rid of it. but yeah she's definitely been losing something every single week and uh, that is awesome because uh, that's one of the things they said that she needed to get under control uh, as well so all of that seems to be going good 
and uh, I really don't have nothing else to add for the day so it is a Sunday I'm going to take the afternoon relax watch a little movies and stuff and uh, I will get back with you tomorrow morning for the weigh-in and we'll just have to see how it goes well that is all for now Till tomorrow you folks have a good one. Mm -hmm.